Hi, I'm Karmi Shammas. I'm your astrologer. Today I'll be talking from the garden outdoors. That's why I was a little bit busy lately. Uh, maybe I um, uh, I missed a few few days, few dailies. But today I think I'm I'm back. So here I am out uh, outside. Um, so I hope you like it. And uh, please excuse the noises because the uh, I'm almost near a street. So excuse that. So basically today. Uh, Friday the 17th the moon is in Capricorn so it should be a nice day if you're Capricorn Taurus if you're Virgo uh, how's it going to be for all signs knowing that tomorrow Saturday the moon will leave uh, Capricorn at 11:30 a.m. universal time so here we go Aries it's uh, I know it's a fine day I wouldn't say it's complicated I'm trying to tone it down so th today is a nice day if you know how to plan ahead if you're unprepared maybe you'll find some difficulties so it's not that horrible but it is a day that you need to take care of 13 14th 15th of uh, April you need to be more careful Moving to Taurus, Taurus, this is a fine day. It's a very nice day actually, and you need to make the best of it. It's um, it's helpful, and you need every single minute of this day because tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday, and even Monday may be complicated. So today is your best bet. You still have few hours um, Saturday morning. So in all cases, whatever you can do today, like uh, resolve a problem, reach a peace uh, uh, decision, may make peace with friends, with families, whoever you have problems with, get things done, and I think you will be um, uh, will be set off. Everybody is lucky today. Moving to Gemini, today is fine. There are things that need to be uh, wrapped up. There are things that need to be to be followed up with, and I think you can do greatly. This is a beautiful day. Some issues need to be uh, dealt with uh, certain authorities, like if you have some uh, issues with uh, insurance policies, maybe health issues, um, uh, banking systems, or whatever it is. Make sure that you are with the right people. Everybody can be lucky today especially those born between the first and the third of june let's move now to cancer cancer this is a day that may trigger may challenge you at a certain moment and i think you may feel a little bit tired a little bit exhausted some negative thoughts cross your minds these negative thoughts they have to be ignored and pushed away other th other otherwise they can cause you problems so make sure that you do the right things and i think you'll be quite fine tomorrow uh, i promise you you're going to spend a beautiful long weekend in the meantime take it easy and uh, if you want my opinion i think you should apologize if you do if you did any mistake Moving to Leo, Leo, this is a day, a long day, actually, but I think definitely whatever you um, complain of today, definitely today is going to be easier uh, and happier and luckier than that, uh, than the conditions that the long weekend present will present. So I'm talking about getting things done, even though you feel tired, even though you feel a little bit um, uh, incapable of doing them but I, I think you have to ask for help because Saturday afternoon Monday and Tuesday can be very complicated moving to Virgo it's a happy day beautiful day I love this day I talked about it yesterday and I seen I, I thought uh, I, I told you, I said that you can be quite lucky. Actually, yes, you can be quite lucky. It's a beautiful, beautiful, happy day. Everybody is lucky today. All of you, even even those born uh, on the 24th, 25th of, um, uh, of August. So whatever you have to do, get on with it, wrap things up. Let's move now to Libra. So Libra, this is a day that make you makes you feel a little bit nostalgic. You want to go deep inside. Yeah, which is great. Um, try not to take things to the extreme. extreme. Try not to overwhelm yourself. Uh, there are some issues that need to be dealt with, uh, maybe with families, with parents, uh, maybe with yourself inside. So in all cases, I think this is a beautiful day things may turn out to be to the best um, especially definitely because planet Venus is in your sign so the luckiest are those born between the 2nd and the 6th of October moving to Scorpio so it's a busy day 
uh, we ha I have to remind you that this is the season of Scorpio few more days and the Sun will leave your sign so this is your best bet to get things done and wrapped up with uh, but planet Mars is still hovering around so you have to be careful um, the moon in Capricorn actually will um, will make things faster you know so everything is faster even your mind is faster even your um your your stamina is stronger so this is a great day for work but drive carefully talk well uh, make sure that you think about whatever you're going to say uh, especially if you were born between the 15th and the 19th of november be careful Let's move now to Sagittarius. So the moon is in the second house of money. This means that you have to be careful. You don't want to overstretch your 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 um, uh, your your spendings uh, expenses. Make sure that you follow the rules uh, that you put for your budget. So you have a certain budget for time, for expenses, for 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 free time. Okay. So whatever it is. Uh, I think you have to make sure that you're doing the right uh, thing. In all uh, cases, uh, try to get things done, Sagittarius, the right way. Planet uh, uh, Mercury is in your sign. It will help you to be more active and more efficient. You just need to concentrate. Let's move to Capricorn with the moon in your sign. This is a super, super beautiful day. Very helpful, very efficient, very strong. Uh, very strong means it's, it's very empowering. It gives you the green light to do whatever you want to do. And I think you're very capable of helping others also, which makes you a prominent person in your community, if you like that. In all cases, this is a day that will help you solve problems and will make things um, uh, move because they were stagnant they were on hold uh, lately so there you are moving to Aquarius and nothing will get moving everything is on hold till uh, tomorrow Saturday morning in the meantime be careful it's a very weak day it's inefficient it's not constructive it may lead you to cause problems and mistakes and probably you will end up very very disappointed and frustrated um, plan B plan C are totally highly recommended Let's move now to Pisces. I love it. Pisces, I love this day. It's quite helpful. You're not on your own. No matter what it is, you'll be totally helped. Everybody wants to jump in and help you. Just ask for help. Join a team. Uh, make sure that you're doing the right thing and uh, wrap things up today because Saturday, Sunday, and even part of Monday can be um, uh, disappointing. Okay? So make sure that you do things the right way today. Uh, let's wrap it up with born on the 17th. This should be a beautiful year, very rewarding. Uh, there are uh, some changes, big changes at work, big changes at school, your career maybe, uh, some innovation, some uh, some updates, you know, that's, that are going to get into your life. Um, Planet Jupiter, which is in Taurus, is going to help you probably with a new deal. And maybe I think you're going to get uh, some nice surprises. So basically, this is it. Wishing you all the best. See you tomorrow. Enjoy. Bye-bye.